Ladies and gentlemen, it is both an honor and a privilege to announce the engagement of Daniel J. McKee, swearing in as the 76th governor of the state of Rhode Island. Joining Governor McKee on the dais will be his wife, Susan McKee, and children, Kara and Matt, and Matt's fiance, Laura. Holding the Bible is his wife, Susan McKee. I call upon the Honorable Nellie M. Gorbea, Secretary of State, to administer the oath of office. of this state of Rhode Island, elected unto the place of Lieutenant Governor and pursuant to the Constitution of the state of Rhode Island, succeeding to the office of Governor, do solemnly swear to be true and faithful unto this state and to support the Constitution of this state and of the United States, that you will faithfully and impartially discharge all the duties of your aforesaid office of Governor to the best of your abilities according to law, so help you God. I do. Congratulations, sir. Ladies and gentlemen, at this time, it is my honor to introduce Major General Christopher P. Callahan, the Adjutant General for the State of Rhode Island. Major General Callahan will make the presentation of the Gorget to Governor McKee. Ladies and gentlemen, please rise for the presentation of the Gorget as we recognize our Captain General. The Gorget history as military armor can be traced back to the high Middle Ages when mail was used to protect the wearer's face and neck. Over 500 years ago, the gorget has developed into an armor component worn around the neck to protect the throat. By the 18th century, the gorget became ornamental, serving as a symbolic accessory on uniforms of leaders. In Rhode Island, the gorget signifies the governor as the Captain General and Commander in Chief of the Rhode Island National Guard and militia units. Ladies and gentlemen, Please remain standing for the playing of Ruffles and Flourishes and Stars and Stripes Forever by the Governor's own 88th Army Band. It is customary for military and law enforcement personnel in uniform to render a hand salute during Ruffles and Flourishes. Ladies and gentlemen, please take your seats. 